Hi, my name is Miriam and I live in the Yishuv Adam. I would love to tell you a bit about the Yishuv and what makes it a special place and different from other places. Uh, first of all, technically the Yishuv is located very close to Yerushalayim, about five minutes away uh, to get to the Piscat Ev area. So we've got more or less the Yerushalayim temperatures, a little bit warmer than Yerushalayim temperatures. Um, Adam is a very large Yishuv, it's called the Yishuv Yironi, which um, has about uh, 14, 1500 families here. So the advantages of that, of course, is that we have more frequent bus service um, about every 15, 20 minutes uh, to Yerushalayim. Um, sometimes it can be even less than every 15 minutes, so that's a real advantage. Um, as well as more services that are located in the issue of different um, uh, medical services and uh, food services, so that's really wonderful. Um, another thing that makes Adam unique is that it's called what's called a mixed issue. Um, it has people from really all around the world, and um, but specifically in Israel, when they say mixed issue, it means mixed religiously. Um, most yeshuvim are usually either just defined as religious or not religious, um, so Adam really has a huge mix of people. We have here in, in Adam a very, very tiny, tiny Anglo community, which is hoping to grow, um, very warm and supportive, and um, that is, um, I think it's, it's, it really is a, a wonderful thing to have, um, but I will say, and I always stress this to anyone who wants to come here, it's really a place that you have to feel comfortable with Hebrew and you have to feel comfortable um, being really with Israelis because there's there really are very few Anglos here and the feel, the vibe of this place is that it is definitely an Israeli issue, fully on Israeli. Um, so that's something that's also very important. Um, but certainly if you want to have that, you know, all out, all out Israeli experience, then that's definitely something that you will experience here. Um, I think that Adam is definitely going to bloom and just continue to grow. Um, so I think now is definitely the time to, to come in. Um, in terms of housing options, right now um, it's a matter of either renting or buying whatever is available. Um, from I don't At this exact moment in time, I mean, I don't think that there are specific huge building projects going on, but I know there is a lot of talk that very soon they, they should have some more uh, large building projects opening up. So hopefully if someone's interested in that, there will be an option as well of being able to build your own place. With the Gan services, there's um, Chabad, there's Haredi, there's um, non-religious and Datilumi. And um, up in the school systems, it's um, non-religious, Datilumi and Haredi that's being offered. Um, so that's, I think, really wonderful, just having that huge variety of people. Another thing that I think is really great about Adam right now is that it is relatively more affordable. Um, unfortunately, so many places here in Israel are, are really pretty hard to afford, and um, especially as the place becomes more Anglo, it, uh, the prices usually go way up. Um, so here this is a place that is still more affordable. Um, and that is, uh, I'd say, the, the things that I think stick out the most about Adam. So um, good luck to you all, and please feel free to call me or write to me with any questions that you might have.